Foot like RD, Danny Boy here, and welcome back to another episode of Two Point Hospital. We are here at the Peverly Beach DLC, where we have the first one, first hospital, which is Peverly Reef. So we've done the Bigfoot DLC, it's now on to this one. So without further ado, let's get started. It's prone to extreme weather. Hmm. The most densely populated area of this island is hot. Yes, okay. <laughs> Welcome to Peverly Reef. Wigbert Wiggy Silverbottom has funded this hospital on the coast on the coast <laughs> of Peverly Island. Currently we are not exactly what you would term official. We will need to clean the place up a bit before the island's medical authorities are willing to recognise this as a hospital and give us a medical licence. Wiggy's using the hospital to make good on all those times he's offered someone a job without thinking it through. For some reason he thought it'd be a good idea for them to work as our janitorial staff. We won't have access to a pool or highly trained medical janitors, instead we'll be able to hire other random totally inexperienced people, we'll need to get training or maybe just hire loads of them, as Pebble A receives some of the most erratic and unique weather in the country. Okay, let's pause. Right, we've got some junk uh, lying around. Wreckage. This looks like the 8 bit machine. Uh, okay, let's sell that for $50. Let's sell that plant. Oh, in fact, let's just sell it. What is this? Lava. Oh no. Not the lava. Uh, sell. Sell. Uh, probably gonna buy, place them back in. I'll place everything back in where I want to place in. Clown poster on the wall. Random seats. Random bin. Uh, let's get rid of this bathroom. Sell. Yes. Uh, so we are getting some more money in. What was that? Ah, this was the... That's the one from the Bigfoot DLC. I don't think we'll have many Frankensteins walking about a tropical island, however. Although we may have some. Uh, let's get rid of that and let's check anything up the back. Yes, there is a hidden cactus and bookcase. Right, let's have a look for staff. No staff as of yet. Okay, first of all, let's hire a janitor. Uh, Lloyd Keish, let's hire you. Uh, do I want to hire all three of them? Yes, I think I do. Uh, hire. Hire you. Okay, right. Let's see, what do we want? We want items to start with. We want a reception. I would like it to face the door there. I want another reception. I would like it to face the door there. Right, so let's hire, for the moment, just a, oh, perfect. You, my friend, are going to work in reception. Excellent. Now, the toilets at this side weren't a bad idea. Uh, rooms, let's get toilets then. One, two, let's make them that large to start with. Put the door there. One, two, three. Let's get a sink. Let's get a hand dryer. Let's just add in a few more things. A bin. A fire extinguisher. Can I fit hand sanitizer on this wall? Yes, I can. Okay, let's get something. Now, air conditioning probably going to play a big part in this. Let's check the temperature. Oh yes, it is very hot indeed. Let's get one there as well. And also one there. Okay, right. That's sort of good thus far. I would like a plant next to my air conditioning unit. And we'll get a clock. Right, 
Right, there we go. There's one level three bathroom. Bathroom facilities. Right. Okay. On to the next. Right, rooms. GP's office. Now I want it to be one, one, two. So let's get one, two, three. GP's office there. Now I'm going to get rid of the temperature because it's rather confusing trying to see all this rubbish. Uh, put in green, no. <laughs> no put in green. It's not going to be that fancy. Fire extinguisher, absolutely, definitely. And I am going to place one there and another one there. Uh, right. Hand sanitizer. Next to the bin. Uh, plant. Large air conditioning unit, please. That can go there. Now, bookcase, maybe. Just to sort of bring up prestige slightly. It's a small room, so it will be difficult to sort of get the prestige up. But by adding some things, i.e. posters, pictures, plants, clocks. Now I am actually looking for the clock, because I want the clock to go in there. I want that to go there, and I would like this to go there. Now that is level 3, and I am happy with that. Now, if I was to copy this room, it does leave a weird shaped gap there. So let's put that there, and let's edit this. And we'll leave a gap along here for the moment. Uh, do you want to stop editing in this room? No. I would like that to go there, yes. Right. So in here, let's get a few things. Let's get some items. First of all, let's get some benches. And I'll get another bench there, and we'll place something like a plant. Right, do the plants first, actually. So I want a plant there. A plant there. I want a large air conditioning unit to go in there. I want an arcade machine there, an endless arcade machine there. Where am I going? Looking for a fire extinguisher. There we go. Fire extinguisher there. Possibly another large air conditioning unit there. And hopefully a bin will fit in there. Yes, it will. Excellent. Alright, let's get some vending machines in. Let's get drinks vending machine. Let's get snack vending machine. Now that looks okay for that side. Now I don't know what exactly are the illnesses we're going to encounter. But let's go rooms. And let's get the training room. Staff room, toilets, training. And we'll do it the same as this. Okay, right, so training is done right at the front of the hospital, or just for the moment. Can't move it later. One, two, three. 
Okay, three desks. Because we want to fit some other stuff in here. We want that. We want that. Whiteboard increases. Classroom prestige. Okay. That there. Fire extinguisher in here, definitely. Large aircon unit can fit perfectly in there. Now we want the anatomy models as well. So we want the display scale in, which sits perfectly there. And we want this, which should hopefully sit at the back there, yup. Uh, let's have a look for the posters. Uh, eye test poster, brain anatomy poster. Goes there. The actual anatomy poster goes there. And perhaps a clock. We'll do the finishing touches for this room. Walk there. Voila, 16,000. We're still at 200. Still at 200. Which is good. Now, rooms I want cardiology. 1, 2, 3. By 1, 2, 3. That goes in there. Whoa. Heart racer, please. There. Wall monitor. Medical cabinet, filing cabinet, maybe some wean scales at one side. Uh, large air condition, air con unit at that side. Perhaps a plant. Maybe a pointy painting and a dog painting. Right, there it is at level three. Clock in the top. Excellent. I want general diagnosis. One, two, three. Now that is the same as the other side, so that's perfect. Bed there, medical cabinet, filing cabinet, weighing scales, do they fit in there? They do. Bin, fire extinguisher, hand sanitizer, large aircon unit at the other side. Uh, the plant in there and again we'll mix it up by putting some different pictures in so we had the dog painting and the pointy painting let's get the mountain painting and the beach painting let's then get a clock There we go, level three. Excellent. Excellent. Right. Got a few fire extinguishers and things littered about the place, which is good, but I would like more. So let's get some more items. In fact, let's check the temperature. So it's slightly hot over here. So let's get items. Let's get large aircon unit there. And perhaps different for no, in fact, we'll get it to the same place at this side there. Okay, we've got room to do things in the back here if we need to. Now, where there's an aircon unit, I also want a fire extinguisher. So, fire extinguisher there. 
fire extinguisher up there. Can I place it against there? No. Invalid wall placement. That's okay. We have one or two lying around. Alright, arcade machine. Endless arcade machine. Uh, a bin. And a plant. Excellent. Over here we'll get a plant. Ski rack? No, I don't think we'll need a ski rack in basically what's virtually the Bahamas. Right, that should be okay for there. Now, get rid of the that. Push play, push pause. Let's hire a doctor. Oh, none of these are any use. Go away. I will happily wait. Ooh, let's get you, because I get a f I get the feeling we're going to need pharmacy. And let's hire you. Uh, let's get you in for training. And diagnostics. Ooh, 12,000, that's expensive. Start training, and away we go. Right, we're underway at Peverly Reef. This guy is in for training. Uh, it said most of the doctors and things were uneducated, but these guys clearly were. Sweep up a hundred bits of litter. I don't know if that's every single bit of litter. We'll soon find out. They are working away though. Then we're going to get someone in for ghost capture. And then we're going to get someone in mechanics. Five days we'll receive a new applicant. You are going to work in the general practitioners. Please, and thank you. What, what's this? I've not actually looked around the island. Oh, okay, so we'll go over here. I can buy this. Oh, everything is so far away. Ooh, interesting. Right, hey are. Oh my god, she's terrible. You applicants, please. Either no one, either someone that's completely untrained, or just has like a one in GP. That would be immensely grateful. Oh, psychiatry, really? Ha! <laughs> what? I might just get her. Just to get the ball rolling, because we might have to do psychiatry at some point, and I can always change her. Let's just wait 15 days. <laughs> right, so that nurse went in for that. Now let's get one of them in for ghost capture. Lloyd, start your training, bud. Gonna get one in for mechanics. Now, we don't have our medical license yet, but people are appearing. Right, six days. Come on, game. Give me something good. Or someone not so good, as it were. Someone absolutely terrible with no train. Oh, my God. Really? Okay, just hire you. Right, for the moment. You're just going to be a GP, but ultimately, you're a psychiatrist. <laughs> uh, not now, as soon as he's finished I'll get you in Right, let's do what we always do Let's go to the prices And hike up What we currently have Excellent Pharmacy required Get the patient to wait Now I have a pharmacy nurse Ooh, I could have two no, let's get rid of that. Alright, pharmacy. Uh, do I want to really mega utilize space here? One, two, three, one, two. That's four. 
Four could be okay. Oh, that's terrible. Uh, edit. <laughs> right, get that in. Throw in the filing cabinet. Why the hell not? Get this in here. Fire extinguisher, obviously, because there's a machine in there. A large aircon unit right in the middle. Plant there. Uh, what else do we need? Right, it's now just a case of adding decoration. We're at level 2. Let's get the seasonal paintings. And get a notice board. Don't know why. It's felt like it. Get a notice board in. Some drawings. Let's get that. And that. And a clock. Right, now. New dude. Or old dude. Uh, your general diagnosis, but I want to change you to just be pharmacy. Hire three John arms. We've almost swept up a hundred bits of litter. She actually had a hundred percent diagnosis there. Magical. <laughs> Assistance, no. John arms are all untrained. So I think it was maybe the John arms that were all untrained. Drawing a blank. Now that the hospital is less filthy, we're legally allowed to call it a hospital. Oh, and start doing medicine and all that. We've also been sent the technology to treat patients with blank look, a disease we're likely to encounter while we're on the island. How does one treat said disease? Uh, let's go to prices. Oh, you got charged 6000 for that. For Sandy Crack. <laughs> okay, train 12 John R's. Oh, I've already trained one. Ooh, that's nice. He's still in training. So that will count as one. Cure 10 patients with a blank look. Now, what I should get, because I've got money currently, get, you're going to be my upgrade, dude. Yes, money. Money we have. Hire doctors eight days. Now the problem is, I want to build research. Now it says thirty-five thousand. Everybody knows that in order to get decent research and do it quickly, you need a few people. So that's two of them and that's 45,000 already. Get a supercomputer in. And a server. And a whiteboard. So we've already racked up about 80,000. <laughs> oh my god. This is dumb. I want the bin by the door. Okay, have the bin there. Of the fire extinguisher next to it. Uh, hello. Have the hand sanitizer on the wall and then get the large aircon unit facing that way. Now it's at level four. So all it's getting now is a clock. And we should probably slow it down. Because a lot of things are happening in the background. Right. Madness, that's insane. Right, uh, not now there is someone currently in for training, let's promote you. Uh, treatment in the pharmacy, that's excellent, because I can put prices up for that. There we go. Toothy Mutiny. Okay, so we want a few more people, right, let's see. Ah, are you a doctor? You are. I'll tire you. Get you in for GP. Uh, right, you. 
don't go for training. You are going to be a GP, and as soon as a training slot becomes available, I will let you train. Excellent. Training slot is available. General practice. You. Expensive. But there we have it. And we still have our psychiatrist. For reasons. What is this? As actual tornado is in the hospital, what the hell's going on? <laughs> Ward required. I could actually build that. Get the patient to wait. Let's have a wee study. Oh yes, you are available as well. Now I could just hire you. In fact, I need to hire you. And you're gonna work in cardiology. What is this? Identification. Is there a room for this? Uh, rooms? Yes, identification. Cures patients with blank look. Okay, do we have anybody with blank? Oh, there's a blank look, dude. You need the ward. I really do want to build the ward. Now, I had... I want to hire you as well. And you're going to be a GP. And then I'll get psychiatry in as soon as possible. And she can go and work in psychiatry. But let's try and build the ward. I'm sure it said ward was 7,500. Well, I doubt it. But we'll see. Let's have the door for the ward there. Uh, invalid location. Why? Because it's too close to a door. Too close to a wall, even. Right, that goes in there. Let's get that there. Fuck, let's get another change in screen. Now, I know I'm supposed to be making this uh, cheap. But it's okay. As long as I can fit six people in here. Or eight. I'm happy. Now that is 18,000. Stick a locker in there. Stick another locker in there. Wall monitor right there. Ooh, needs to be moved. Okay, needs to be moved to there. Medicine cabinet, I do want. Filing cabinet, no. Weighing scales, not particularly needed at the moment. Fire extinguisher, absolutely needed at the moment. Uh, large aircon unit, there. Possibly one there. One times plant in the corner. We're at 20,000 hand sanitizer. Now a few, a couple of pictures, dog art. Pointy painting. A notice board in the back. Maybe get some drawings or something, there we go. And a clock. Okay, now we could have got up to level 4, but level 3 I'm happy with. Right. Prices? Right, war diagnosis? No. But for hermetism? Yes. Yes, please. Right, push play. Now I know I don't currently have anybody to work in there. Nurse wanted on the ward. Right. You possibly no. Let's get rid of her. Janitors no. We're good for janitors. We do have to train some janitors up. That's going to be expensive. We need to keep treating people in the pharmacy. That's what we need to do. Seven days for a doctor now. I wouldn't mind a research doctor. 
<laughs> Come on, Blank. Blank, Doctor. Oh, God. Cut. Pigmento. No thanks. Uh, no, I've already got... Damn it. I need a ward person. Someone, anyone. Let's promote you and promote you. Okay, there are now a few people waiting for the war. That's bad. We are staying above the money. Just. Well, in terms of money, we're staying above it. <coughs> Excuse me. Yes, we have a research room. But we... Oh my god! Wait a second. Research. You. Her. Start training. Away! Okay, right, staff. Uh, you, lady. Jobs. It's gonna be research. Once you've done it. Right, now, as soon as I look in here, it's probably gonna give me a rest. Oh, Kirk Damp. I could still use Kirk Damp. As a GP. Now, if someone comes in needing psychiatry right now, I will be delighted. In fact, I won't, because I don't have room for psychiatry. Uh, VIP patient. Diagnose and cure a patient. Oh my god, people are being struck by lightning! <laughs> they were already dying, and now they're probably going to be dead even quicker. Right, so if I can get... Let's actually take out a loan. Let's just take the hundred grand one. Probably gonna need it. Find out what the next cheapest block is. So that's 30,000. 35. Over here, 40. Woof. 50. Woof. I'm thinking this one. That's 35. This one is 30. Okay, so we'll bear that in mind. Not now. I actually do want to train you, and yes. So we've got a celebrity visit and a VIP patient. Okay, we've got 10 people waiting for the ward. Oh my god, really? Oh, in fact, there won't be 10 people waiting for the ward. That's complete nonsense. Half of them will disappear. Now, if you didn't have this stupid diagnosis slot, actually, there's more people waiting for the ward. What? How is this possible? You need a diagnosis. Sufficient for treatment in the pharmacy. Well, that wasn't hard. Right, you're going to be doing research very shortly my dear and you have all the tools in the world at your disposal to do so <gasps> excellent how are you you're gonna be my my nurse ward lady now i know you're untrained and i'm throwing you in at the deep end but such is life okay we don't have this so let's just get rid of that right on you go start curing people if you can't that would be magic. Now, diagnosis. I'd love to use her to do diagnosis, but there's so much cues. Uh, you are the new dude. You are the guy we had first. Right, you're going for training, my, my, my dude. You're going to get diagnosis up. There's the VIP. Famous rock star arriving. Famous actor arriving. He actually looks famous as well. Oh god. What the hell's going on? <laughs> right. Uh, further diagnosis. Promote you. Right. Upgrade. No. Get this done. Start project. Now it's halfway done. So if I could get at 45,000, it would be an absolute miracle. Right, train janitors, no. We're currently training a cardiology dude. We have you. Send for treatment. Blank face. Okay, send the patient home. 
Now we need all the money I can get, so instead of going around the hospital and finding people I can't cure, we're just going to leave them thus far. There's a lot of people waiting for cardiology and general diagnosis. But I'm happy to let them queue and pay for it. Prices. Now we've put all the prices we can up. Yes, that is correct. Uh, I do have a janitor trained in ghost capture. I don't know where he is currently. Right. Uh, nurse lady. Accept. You're going to be trained in... Ward management. God, it's expensive. Curse you, training. Right, go for training. I've got another untrained nurse that I would also... We've got another researcher. Get you in there. Now, I spent money... All about ten minutes ago to train up a researcher. No one has fallen in my lap. And I don't really need it, but she can help. Now, I don't know why you left. I've just increased the amount of people that can work in that room. And we're getting there. Project Cheesier Gubbins is a go. Right. <laughs> the money is hanging in there. I don't know how. Uh, staff promotion, promote. Oh, okay, my researcher got promoted. I still need to cure, or not to cure, I still need to train janitors. Okay, let's go to hire. Now, there was a blank nurse here. Let's get you in there. I am going to increase this to two. And I'm going to change you to just work in the ward as well. But I'll get you trained up in treatment when I have the refuse to pay. Curse you, lady. I need that money. Oh my god, more of these seismic anomalies that are absolutely mental. <laughs> People are saying that they need drinks and stuff, but there are drinks. The vending machine, although almost did get hit by a by a lightning bolt. Right, so we've got two people working in the... what do we call it? In the ward. That's good. I'm gonna train up another janitor in maintenance. I'm then gonna train up that other nurse. Cure 10 patients with blank look. Once we've sort of got this base building sort of up and running, I will be happier. I'll then expand. First thing I'm going to do is get a staff room. Uh, teaching. Yep, teaching's always one of them because we've just taught so many people. Now you, dude, you've got blank luck and you're dying. So go home. Identification. Send patient home. Send patient for treatment. Sorry, dude. This dude is leaving. You one of my nurses? Oh. Dude. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Send patient home. Right, we're starting to get the identification room thing through now. Now, I want a maintenance janitor. This also adds to one of my goals of training janitors. Cure rate's probably going to be quite low for the moment. Uh, what is this? Psychiatry required! Get patient to wait. Push pause. Right. Cheapo section, this section. Right. Let's get that built. 15 or so something days. That's fine. We'll get psychiatry. We'll move her over to psychiatry. Now let's go to the hiring screen. There is a blank doctor. Let's hire you. 
and get you in GP's office. Yep. Uh, special report. We did not diagnose and cure the patient. Okay, send patient for treatment and I uh, go 90 days without a death. Pfft, virtually impossible. Identification required, send the patient home. Reducing prices a bit will improve hospital reputation, my friend, but they'll also bankrupt us, so no. We can't do that. Right, this is done. Now, this is gonna seem kinda stupid. Now, I'm gonna get the super duper awesome staff room in first. Uh, keep building out about there. Okay, now we can place the door in. Right, luxury sofa in the corner. Why the hell not? Luxury armchair right next to it. Uh, television facing that way. Right, we're at level two. Level two already. Dartboard. Let's get sofa there coffee table in the middle it's got like a lamp or something in the corner there we go uh, what was that? I was looking for the armchairs there we go armchair one armchair two Beanbags. Beanbag one, two, three. Excellent. Football beanbag one, two, three. Putting green. Let's get a putting green in the back here. <laughs> Right, we're at level 3 prestige, which is pretty decent. Let's get the bin in. Bin. Fire extinguisher. Large aircon unit. Hopefully it goes there. Another one there. Endless arcade machine, or normal arcade machine, and then endless arcade machine. There we are at level four. The coffee maker. Drinking fountain by the door. A bookcase. A plant. Uh, hand sanitizer. Where's the fish? Thing. There we go, fish enclosure. <laughs> oh, what an amazing staff room. Uh, the globe, globe can go in the corner. Can it? Yes. <laughs> right, rugs. Standard sort of yuck rug. Ace of speed rug. Can go there. Cart rug for the blue bean bags. Football rug or space rug for the gaming machines pitch rug for them. Maybe a retro rug here and a duck rug this side. Now it's already at level 5, but we're going to get some painting. So we'll get one canvas there, one there, another one there. We'll get the notice board in there, clock right there, and 
Volley canvas. Hothouse canvas. Boom. Okay, right, that's in. Rooms. Psychiatry. Small psychiatrist's office. Diagnostic bookcase. Treatment bookcase. Ooh. If you scoosh over a touch. Okay, that goes there. Next one goes there. Okay, that's fine. Medicine cabinet. Filing cabinet we're going to leave. Uh, bin. Fire extinguisher. Hand sanitizer. Uh, plant. Rug. Signed Jasmine Odessa photo. Frame sportswear. And a clock. Level 3. Right. Stuff. Let's change you up. You are now only going to work in psychiatry. And we are rolling. Right. Duolux Clinic. Uh, send the patient home, I'm afraid. And let's go to prices. Diagnosis and psychiatry. I'm not going to do that. Just treatment. So straight away, I need to change this room to treatment only. Send the patient home. That's two. That's three for Deluxe Clinic. You want to be promoted, that is fine. Right, we've got some money. Let's do another training course. Let's get that second GP trained up. We're going to have to pay for it. Which sucks. How are you guys coming on with this? They're almost done. Psychiatry emergency. Yes, please. Since the psychiatrist is now in. Uh, treatment in psychiatry. Excellent. Not now. Well, let's get prices for that other psychiatry thing up. 50. Excellent. Let's start the money rolling in. So we're doing okay. We're not doing too bad. Cure rate is going to be a bit disastrous. Uh, water 40 plants is done. Okay, that was easy. <laughs> We're back up to 72,000. Someone obviously got cured in psychiatry. They now have their level 5 staff room. Let's just have a look here and see what goes down. Right, she cured him and he paid 10,500. Very nice. So the next person will also be 10,500, whether they're cured or not, unless they refuse to pay, which is highly likely my prices are rather high, but we need to get money. Ooh, and we got 45,000 for completing that research. Now just with the two of them, that did not take that long, which is awesome. Right, one failed, one passed. Let's see how she gets on. Now, if she needs to go for a break, she just has to nip virtually out the door and through the next door. That's another one done. VIP, okay, we may be able to diagnose that person, maybe. Uh, I am gonna get treatment one and you start training. Okay, we're looking okay. We do have a person who's undiagnosed. We now have two people who are undiagnosed. Uh, identification required, send the patient home. 
I will attempt to do that in the next episode. We need a deluxe clinic as well. They're saying it's rather hot in there. These earthquakes don't help. Go away. She's going for a break. Looks like we failed the, the other one. There you go. Have a break. Have a kick cat. There you go, she looks delighted. Staff training required? Not now. I don't think I can send any of them for training. There's so much queues. This person's away for a break also. So it looks like GP's gonna be one of those maddening things again. Gonna need tons of GP's. But you will do better working in the ward once you've got that up. So 11 and 11, that's crazy. Staff promotion, promote you. That was one of our research docs. Not now, I will train the janitors. I'm happy with three at the moment. Dulux clinic, send patient home. Right, but we are gonna leave it there for the moment. And we will come back to this hospital in the next episode. So it looks kind of interesting. I need to figure out, or I need to build that blank face or re-identification room. Because I would like to see what that is all about. But that is going to be it for this episode. As always, if you did watch this and you'd like to leave a like, comment or dislike, please feel free to do so. And if there is more you would like to see in the future, then uh, hit that subscribe button. But I've been Danny Boy, this has been Two Point Hospital on the Beverly Beach DLC, and I will catch you later.